Okay, you guys, I have been shuffling this deck um, off and on all day because every day I'm shuffling and emotional manipulator keeps popping out. So I just wanted to see um, what this is about. The first card to pop out is early adulthood and it says 18 through 20. So some of you guys may have a child that is around that age or this is the person, um, it could be you, it could be the person that is trying to use some type of manipulation tactics. Um, we have pregnant and there it is, emotional manipula pregnant and emotional manipulator. I don't know if um, what I don't know what that has to do with anything with the early adulthood, but someone is pregnant and manipulating someone to stay with them, or someone is lying like they're pregnant. Let's let's is the person pregnant or I'm hearing that someone is pregnant, but it's not yours. <laughs> So I'm assuming that this message is for a male. I'm hearing something about check the dates. Um, so if someone has been to the doctor, especially if they've had some type of scan, uh, free game, right, for uh, men or, you know, whatever, um, at the top, it's going to say like estimated conception date. Someone needs to check the date and make sure that you were even around or with this person at that time yeah i mean it's an estimate they're pretty spot on um you know sometimes they do change throughout the course of the pregnancy by you know a couple of days you know it just depends but it, it just feels like something is all the way off like I feel like almost like a month off or something like that, like with a date that someone is giving another person. So this isn't like, um, you know, a couple of days. I feel like this is like a whole month, possibly two months off. Like, I don't know. <laughs> well, I would say I don't know what person thinks that they can get away with that. But honestly, I'm not trying to be funny. But the way that a lot of um, men are when it comes to females like in pregnancy, you guys have you guys don't have a clue. So there's something to do with like checking a date. Yes. Someone's going to hold another person hostage with like some type of pregnancy or I mean, I don't want to I was going to say like a, a fake pregnancy, but it's not fake. I don't think it's fake. I just don't think it's yours. We have Scorpio that came out. So the person that you're dealing with is a Scorpio or you're a Scorpio, some type of Scorpio. The baby, the real baby daddy is a Scorpio. I mean, I don't know. Someone is a Scorpio or some type of news is going to bring an end to this particular situation because Scorpio is also about like death and rebirth. It's like, it's almost like someone is being given a gift. Uh, number one, this gift of some type of knowledge, um, but so that you can X this. So you can put it, in, you can dead this issue is what I'm hearing. And you can move on to what it is that you were originally, like someone was originally intending to go towards another person or some other situation or something that they wanted to do. But yeah. Um, okay. So at the bottom, it says bros over hoes. I feel like the actual father of this child. Ooh, I feel kind of hurt, but it is someone's bro. Like, I don't want to say specifically like your brother could be, but I feel like this is like one of like one of your I'm here rolling with the homies like this is a close friend or someone that you really hang out with. Um, I almost feel like both parties the male and the female that are involved like the bro and then this female like they are trying like someone has money i'm assuming that it's like whoever this message is for um or even if you don't have money like you're gonna make it work like you must not like <laughs> I, I don't mean it that way i was about to say you must not have kids because you know just think about like the first kid like you go all in for that first kid um so someone knows that like, even if you don't have a lot of money right now, which I think that this person, whoever this is for you do, like 
they know that like you're gonna go all in like you're gonna work morning noon and night whatever you have to do to provide for this child and it's almost like they have some type of pact or some type of deal with where they're going to like split like i don't know it's going to be financially beneficial to these parties that um this this uh bro and this hoe I shouldn't have said yes I should I shouldn't have said I sh yes I should have let's keep going I, I need to mind my own business I mean I don't know their lives okay so I'm gonna leave it with this one but that's funny I'm telling you what did I I told you that this card kept popping out that's why I was like let me go ahead and do this reading and um wow that is very interesting Let's see what else we get that comes out of here. Um, this is just going to be a quick message, you guys. I wasn't planning to like do much. I was just being nosy. Like, what is that? Why does that card keep coming out? Like, what is that about? Yeah, walking away and it's in reverse. It's like someone didn't want another person to walk away from them. You could be a, this could be for an older gentleman that's dealing with some like young, pretty young thing or something like that. And uh, you didn't really know what you got yourself into. Um, yeah, you thought that like you found the one, um, someone I'm hearing like to, um, I'm actually hearing that what was it coming to America when, um, Eddie Murphy was, um, uh, I don't know, he was singing that song. Yes, yes, you too. Like he was all in love or to be loved, to be loved. Oh, what a feeling to be loved. Like, but this person didn't really. Oh, I should be really gentle with this, um, but I can't. Like, you really thought this person... <laughs> I'm sorry, this is not nice. You really thought that this person... Someone really thought that this person loved them. I, but I feel like it almost feels like a little bit of, if you believe in it, like karma. Because at the same time, I'm hearing like, you, you, um, you really had me thinking that I was... I wasn't that jazz. Like, I don't know. It was some, it's something that I heard on TikTok. Like she's saying, like, you really had me thinking that I wasn't that girl. Like, you know, um, so I feel like you could have walked away from someone or you left someone hanging, like someone left another person hanging um, for this pretty young thing. And you thought that you would be able to like build and mold and, you know, all of that stuff uh with this young person that was like that's way too young for another person i don't know <laughs> i don't know i don't know i don't know strategy is at the bottom like someone thought they were gonna build or rebuild with someone that was younger or something like that i mean i don't know again because i need to mind my business but you thought you were going to be able to manipulate right like this person was going to be pliable and putty in your hand and they played that role they played that part and you were the one that was actually getting played. You were the putty. Like, I don't know who this is for. Yeah, someone like we have third chakra, Archangel um, Chamuel. Like this was, this is a blow to someone's confidence. It's about to be a blow to someone's confidence. And I'm hearing rightfully so. Like someone was confident in their ability to manipulate this pretty young thing, but they got manipulated. The player got played. Like that's how this feels. And someone needed this, like this blow to their confidence, to their ego, right? But it's like someone thought they hit jackpot with uh, whatever this is. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And I feel like the only reason it's a problem, you guys, because I don't really think that like, you know, like if everyone is old enough, consenting adults and all of that good stuff and, you know, you each make one another happy. I don't care if she was with you for the money or you're with her for her youth or, you know, whatever. Like, I, I don't see anything wrong with that. Like if you're consenting adults and I feel like typically or generally there, this would not be a problem except for the fact like you both were playing each other. So like, like there's no problem. There's no loss there the only problem is that I feel like someone made another person feel really bad or left another person hanging there's something to do with that yeah we have thinking man at the bottom like you someone thought that they found a shinier object someone got like there's something with this shiny 
with this shiny, shiny object syndrome. I split the deck and there's door to spirit. This was, I'm telling you, this is like some type of uh, come upon, so you know, whatever. Yeah. Somebody, yeah. Mm. Mm -mm. Six chakra, archangel, Metatron. This is the third eye. Someone knew. I feel like whoever was left hanging, like someone knew that they were supposed to give to this person or like this person was being gifted to them, the person that they left behind. But they felt like I'm hearing God's plan, like someone felt like their plan was better than God's plan. So they came up with their own. They thought that they could just like finagle their way into like another. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. We have angel of strength in action. Like it's like someone thought that their plan was better or like that they like, you know, I don't know. Someone feels like they believe that they someone feels like they live above like spiritual law or like someone doesn't believe like someone someone doesn't believe in in the most high or something like that i mean i don't know and what i like to tell people is like whatever it is that you know people oh i don't believe in this or i don't believe in that it doesn't matter it believes in you you don't have to believe and now somebody knows that wow Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh. I hope not. I'm having some really bad pain. It feels like um it feels like a pain in like the ovary area. I don't know if someone is going to have a, a loss, like a um ectopic pregnancy. I'm hearing, fuck, guess we both got played. Yeah. Okay. We have blossoming abundance and happy family. I feel like someone still has an opportunity um, to move towards something. I mean, I don't know. We have goddess of the moon. And we have a adjacent possibilities. I think someone still is able to make, I'm hearing the right decision or a decision that's going to lead to a happy family and blossoming abundance. If this is someone um, that you don't have kids and you feel like time is running out, I feel like it's, it's not. Or maybe like if this is like for an older person, like, I feel kind of bad laughing and all of that stuff. Cause, I mean, it wasn't laughing at that. It's just like the whole situation of trying to manipulate one another. But it feels like maybe if this, if the person is older, like if the guy is older and he chose this pretty young thing, um, not necessarily because she was pretty, but because she was young and not because she was young because they just like young you know, women, but because they felt like they would have a better chance of like having a family. Yeah, it could be something like that as well. How bad? But it could not. So, you know, whatever. Um, but I feel like you still have an option, which was the path that someone was originally supposed to take. Like, don't... Like, just because the person was older, it didn't mean that they couldn't provide you with a family. So someone needs to know that. Yeah. Yeah. I think that like, especially with this goddess of the moon, like that was a secret reason or a hidden reason. Or maybe like the young person didn't have kids. And so someone didn't want to be with another person because they already had kids or something like that. And they wanted everything to be like a new experience. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, we have hostilities and we have rest and rejuvenation. I feel like someone is going to feel like they have gone to war or gone to 
um, you know, has been through the ringer after, you know, like whatever this is that comes out. Um, but, you know, take some time to rest, to rejuvenate, to recuperate, and everything will be as right as rain. Um, at the bottom, we have that woman holding a heart. So I feel like this person um, who I feel like someone really does care about, this person may, um, this person has a, you still have a place in this person's heart, potentially, um, you know. And we at the top, we have seventh chakra, Archangel Uriel. I feel like that, you know, this is like your crown chakra, right? The knowing. But I also feel like this person is going to understand. So I feel like don't keep things a secret. Like, yeah, don't be deceptive. I split the deck and there's deceit. Like, don't be deceptive over like why you ghosted someone or why there was some type of silence or left on red or that type of an energy. Just explain it. And I feel like even if the person is hurt, they're going to understand. They have like a, you know, like they're, they, they're going to understand a whole lot more than what you would think or, you know, like maybe you wouldn't necessarily be understanding in that particular scenario, but you know, you're not them and they're not you. And that's actually what truly makes this person the gift that they are, that the most high, and that's why the most high was trying to present this person to you. So I don't know, but I'm going to leave it there, you guys. Uh, this is Misty with Cancerian Chronicles. Um, thank you so much for watching. I hope that these messages were helpful. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share the video, all that good stuff. I love you and have a beautiful and fantabulous rest of your day. Bye now. Mm -hmm.